How's my volume? I think. You okay? Grimthorpe, welcome. I real I didn't realize yesterday that today was a holiday, so I decided I'll I'll do a little streaming today. Uh, when I did realize that, well, I did realize, but it was <laughs> got a little cat scratch fever. <laughs> My short dark hair. It's doing something annoying in the middle. I don't like it. Okay, my team. Team split. Uh, doing what they were before. This is my team that I was running the, uh, the, um, the marsh dungeon with. No one could do which actually, I needed to look up which dungeon I need to run to get the tome. Okay, I've got hiccups now. To level Cyrus up to level to four stars, because he's three stars right now. And the others, uh, probably would be good to level up all of them. Uh, but I can never remember. Which, uh, things I gotta run. Neko Lolly is a bit disturbing on the voice lines. I think she's supposed to be... Something? Uh, I don't know what she... she actually doesn't annoy me. There's two. I run into so many enemies! Man-eating marsh. Oh, I can't- okay, I can get Cyrus's town in the man-eating marsh. All is well. Where this there is, is light, light. There are shadows. Like, who is that? But that must have been Filmina. I actually have... Pyramus, Filmina, and, uh, Nakoko here. That's like three-fourths of my, uh, Otherlands team. So... No, I'm gonna go this way. That'll be... Helpful if I ever decide to run that. Probably, probably shouldn't run that, uh, but I might anyway. I definitely shouldn't. I should not run other lands. They, they they have been left. They have been left on the wayside long ago. Oh yeah. So uh, the the reason that I run just kind of whoever is because she can solo this dungeon. The rest of these people don't matter. All I need is Jeremus for a hard, hard, um, man eating marsh. Very hard, I don't know if she could uh, handle on her own. It does take three turns. Come on, come on, attack. We just do a dragon, uh, a, a summoner's ritual, no, not summoner's ritual. Summoner's gift, and then we do, uh, do three drag or twin dragons twice in a row, and we win. Level 50 now. Some of these people are sadly low levels. Anyway, I figured I'd, I'd do some of the side quests I've been neglecting. There were actually two I picked up in, uh... In, uh... I can't remember the name of the place anymore. No, I don't need that. I need an app. Oh, actually. Well, first we'll, we'll travel to, uh, Miglance. I don't- I don't understand these things. They are what they are, though. I'm not going there? I've never been to Rind. I guess because I don't need to. I might be allowed to go now, though. Oh, Unigan, that's where I'm going. My highest level character has reached level 50. Very fancy. Yeah, I picked up some quests here about, like, uh, let's see what we're uh, This was quite a while back, and I picked them up, and then I never did them. Uh, we need to investigate the rumors of a hero in Unigan, that is probably Aldo, and we need to go buy uh, medicine for a carpenter and Rin. The medicine is in Rin, the carpenter is uh, here. And I guess somehow we need to talk to this child. This must be for the uh, finding out of the hero. Hey kid, you got a minute? What is it, mister? Have you heard the stories about the, uh, hero that have been going around? Of course, everyone in town is talking about it. Can you tell me what the stories say? Yeah, I know all about it. 
So, um, the castle got attacked, and he beat up the Beast King, and he's really strong, and his name's Aldo, and, and... Sounds fine so far, but why is he being called a hero? What's so special about him? So he's really big and tall and muscly, and he's, and he's strong, and his body's made of iron. Attacks bounce right off him. You. And he can break boulders with one punch and knock down ca castle walls with his kick. And he's got this secret move where he shoots lasers out of his eyes. Aldo Beam. He's so totally cool, people say half the damage to the castle was done by him. Nothing gets in a hero's way. <laughs> I never did anything like that. Huh? Why are you so mad, mister? Uh, uh, you see, my name's Aldo. Wow, same as the hero. You could say that, yeah. Actually, I am the Aldo who defeated the Beast King. No way, you don't look strong at all. You're all skin and bones. The Beast King would have eaten you for breakfast. Sorry I don't live up to the hype, but it's the truth. I dunno, you're so different from what I've heard. Is this a trick? Are you a con man? No, I'm Aldo, the one and only. Honest. What'll it take for you to believe me? If you're really him, you should be strong. I heard the merchants saying there was a monster on the Carrick Swamplands they've been having trouble with. Go beat it up. If you can do that, I'll believe you. Alright, no problem. I defeat strong monsters all the time. Yay, this is gonna be fun. You're coming too? Duh, how else will I know it was you that beat it? Out of the question. It's too dangerous. Don't be a party pooper. Let's go. How do I get myself into these messes? This is why you don't talk to children. They're, uh, evil. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a fair takeaway from that. West over there. No, no, it's not blue, that's purple. I wish to talk to this guard. I wish to go to the swamp one. Eat the monster. Then we gotta go to Rind and get medicine. After we prove to children... Uh... Something. I don't know. We, we probably should just let the children be, really. We have this cat? I have this cat. Hello, Leon. Leon? His name's probably Leon. Children are good at talking you into things. If child labor was allowed, they'd make killer salespeople. <laughs> Thank goodness it's not, then. There it is. That's the monster, right? Ew, it's so gross. Hurry up and beat it. Whatever you say. Watch and learn. Watch as Aldo disappears and my other team of people appears. Summoner's gift. That's what we want. Ah, they could not stand up to Tyrannus. Pretty impressive, right? Do you believe me now? What, just for defeating that thing? That was only a test. A test? Never said that was the monster everyone's been talking about, did I? You little... Okay, so where's the real one? This way. Hey, don't run off on your own. These giant blue flowers. I wish there were giant blue flowers where I live. I would go admire them. Also giant glowing mushrooms. I feel like there's a tragic lack of giant glowing mushrooms in real life. So this is the monster we've been after. It really is this one this time, right? Yeah, it is. I promise. Now take it down. Alright, this time I'll show you what I'm made of. Trust this child. He's manipulative. Got a little cat scratch fever. I wonder if Nakoko would. Gotta plant some flowers, I reckon. Mm. Flowers even come in giant and blue. They probably do. Ah, how's that? Not bad, huh? Hmm, maybe this thing wasn't so strong after all. Stupid child! Wait, it's not safe. Rawr. Hard. Phew, that was close. Looks like it's time for round two. This time you're going down. Are you alright? Ow, that wasn't very heroic, mister. 
I know, I'm sorry. I should have done better, huh? But I guess you were kind of cool when you jumped in to save me. Gee, thanks. I think I've proved my worth enough for one day. Let's get you home. Right. And this is why we don't go out of our way to prove that we are not a rampaging hero to children. This cat is so pudgy. Love it. You're a fool to challenge First I gotta me. kill these guys. I think her summoner is much cooler actually than fine. Why are you so... Why is your voice so great? really helpful to have in the front line, but if you're in the front line, then I have to listen to you talk. Which is the same problem I have with Victor, actually. I don't want to listen to him talk! I'm eating some potatoes. But this time, they aren't just a baked potato that I'm eating. It's real food. Well, here we are. Was this little adventure proof enough for you? Yeah, uh, you were cool and all, but there's just one thing. My favorite ribbon got torn when you pushed me out of the way of that monster. Oh, I'm sorry. Want me to buy you a new one? No thanks. I'll keep it to remind me of the clumsy hero that saved me. I can live with that. Does that mean you finally believe I'm the real Aldo? You might not be everything I was expecting, but yeah, I can't deny it. Why is it so important to you what a kid thinks anyway? Don't you have better things to do, Mr. Hero? Eh, <laughs> when you put it that way? Hey, how about you tell your friends what happened today? I don't want people to get the wrong idea about me. Sure, I can do that. The old stories only took a day to spread around. Sigh. Wait, you're the one who made all that up, you little? Rumors of the Invincible Hero soon faded from public memory. People of Unigan now speak of Aldo as a clumsy underdog with a swelled head. Child is dangerous. Okay, now we gotta go to Rin. Cat. Hello, fluffy cat. Cats distract me very easily. That person has a bunch of melons. Melons. Hey, I don't need to talk to any of these people. Now we can make our way over to Rin at long last. We weren't allowed to go over here before because they're soldiers. Um, but I think ever since the uh, castle attack, we've been allowed to go here. I just uh, didn't make it over until now. Hello, Brom. You are mine now. Horns, cats, collect the cats. I think that red thing over there is a what do they call it? Chance encounter. Take that for a zombie. We can beat her four, four or five times. We have to beat her so many times, and then to join us. We should probably see if we can take on her first first one. Shouldn't be too hard. Bene. Asta. We'll go get this cat over here first and then we'll go over to Azami. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Take that! Huh? Everything right. is for the divine. You're fine. Probably should switch my team up. Team? 
go. And keep working on these people's levels. My goal is to get them all to, uh, Korea. My goal is to get them all to four stars, uh, so they suck less. Okay. They'll get more abilities and better stats. And they'll be able to go to level 60 instead of level 60. As is, they're capped at level 60. Time is a luxury we don't have. Uh, kitty! Colone. Hello, Colone. Or my friend now. It's Lokito! I don't even have a copy of him. We're gonna go speak. He was one of my my two five stars in my original game. Ito and Tuba. And I don't have either <laughs> this time around, and it's making me a little sad. I mean, they're not anywhere near as good okay, as Tiramis. Who's next? Nostalgia. I don't get people wanting to shoot the breeze with me very often. I ain't nothing to be afraid of. These fists of mine are for pummeling beasts, not humans. You probably think I'm weird for turning on my kinsmen, right? Aramis is kind of messed up. I mean, as you saw last time, though, she does- when she falls off, she falls off hard because of her fixed damage. Huh, people usually laugh when I say that. You really are some odd devil. I, I really need to get some other people who are strong enough to back her up. <gasps> look at this tiny orange cat! Bean! Look at his smiley face! Purple furry. He's half beast. Half human. And for some reason that makes him a furry. I am a zombie, a samurai from the east. You look as though you're fairly skilled in sword play yourself. You better helping me train. Have no fear. I say training, but really all I want is someone to cross swords with. Badly in need of more battle experience. Will you help me train? I'll certainly try. My thanks. Come, let us waste no more time. Excuse me. I'm gonna send you flying. Level 40. Okay, we probably can cope with her. Target acquired. Eat this! Probably acquire a sword maiden. We're gonna have to fight her a lot more times before she'll join us, unfortunately, and uh, we definitely are not in a place where we can defeat her uh, all of her forms yet, I'm pretty sure. Not her forms, but because she gets stronger each fight. I think the last fight is level 80. And uh. Hit confirmed. Oh, I should see if we can start trying to get Garyu. He's in antiquity somewhere. There's three of these chance encounter characters. There's a zombie in the present, Therian in the future, and uh, Gary in the past. And Gary is a mage with an AoE fire ability and is actually the only one I still. Uh, even though I don't very much! We're not in the greatest position right now. That's just because we're low on mana. My strength is yours! Come on, Cyrus. Here we go! Medical support activated. Time for you to help out. Just keep debuffing her and hope that keeps her down. Exterminate. Got six debuffs going right now. 911 damage. Heals again. Uh, no! Medical Helena's support. dead! I mean, Helena's not all that useful, really, but I like using her anyway. Actually, no. You rest, frontline. You. That is the problem with my poor three star people, is because they're three stars, they are very slow now compared to the other characters. Come on, okay, you can debuff her power. Good. Because she keeps debuffing our in, I guess. Which is fine, because we're not using mages. Well, Helena's a mage, but she wasn't doing it. I can another force her down. Let's see if our little three stars can do it. Come on, guys. Give it all you've got. I don't think they can do it. <laughs> They're too weak. <laughs> they just don't hit hard enough. Everyone, give me your strength. 
That's, that's the one that Cyrus and Aldo do. Yeah, it's their special. If you fill up the entire bar, there's like special ones that happen, and Aldo has oh, one for no. just him. There's one for him, and they each have a little stat thing that they have. And if you have a bunch of people with the same weapon type, or a bunch of people with the same trait. There's one for Sweet Tooth, or I think Synth, I think Synth, Synth Humans have one. I don't know why it would have What a and for I think a while, I don't know if it was possible to do the katana one, katana weapon one, because it would always just do the katana, because uh, all the katana users are eastern, so our characters that aren't five stars just trash in the long term. Uh, for the most part, yeah, I'd, I'd say so. I don't know if that's accurate, but I'd say so. Um, luckily, like all the story okay. characters can get up to Who's five next? stars, and then there's these three three characters that can get to five stars, so. You're not stuck with just trash. You uh, just don't pull it all, or somehow have it. I was gonna say somehow have atrocious luck, but there are occasional guaranteed five stars, so you'd have to just like ignore those pulls. Not bad at all. I'm glad I found myself such a capable training partner. They did buff the story characters like last month because they'd fallen behind quite a bit, so they buffed their skills a lot, so that they still are. Well, I mean they were usable, but they're uh, better now. I hope I can improve my skills and I will challenge you again. Good for you. Why does she just have a boob plate? Uh, she felt like it. Beat a zombie once. Let's eat our food and see if we can beat her a second time. <laughs> there used to be a time delay, like you had to wait six hours between cha these challenges, but uh, with old content, they the, once it's old enough, like. I don't know how long, maybe once like six months have passed or something, they remove the time delay so you can just challenge them. Oh, I didn't read her first line. Hello again. I've gained some valuable experience, but this is no time to rest on my laurels. The other day, I dispatched these things called gobberins that were running wild on the Nuaro Plains. I only care about hits. You can stab me anywhere else. Now look, she's got some shoulder armor. She doesn't want to be stabbed in the shoulders either. If you like to see the fruits of my labor. In any case, how about another sparring match? My thanks. Now behold, the techniques that brought peace to the plains. Wish to die? Step forward. You have to go to the. Her armor scheme is a little lacking. You feel? I think she's here to to be hot, not. Uh, you know, although I don't know, she's she's not skimpy, so I, I don't really know why. Uh, we'll bring in Aldo because he's got more debuffs. Actually, wait. I do want you to debuff our intelligence. Really shocking. Shocking. I don't think debuffing her int matters that much. She's mostly physical attacker. Exterminate. Go level away. 40, then 50. Yeah, I think we have five fights. She's level 50 this time. And then the next time she'd be level 60, and then level 70, and then level 80. I think we can probably only defeat her first two versions. She's a wind wind element katana. Let's point till the end. Poor Amy isn't all that good against her. Fire is good against her. Oh. Wait, I need my healer. Oh wait, actually we have 2012 health. <laughs> Whenever someone has health that's almost a year. Well that is a year that like happened recently, that amused. Gift, heal. Debuff her power. Cyrus has a debuff that one chance, so we'll swap him to the front. My strength is yours. Or oh, Ricka. Really Ricka, I really need to get Ricka to four stars because three star healer is not good. That again. No, no, I don't want Holy Ray. I want her heal. With that. I don't know why she's weak. Is she weak to slash, maybe? Mika. Come on. We can do this. That's so much. Can actually. We need to keep up the heals. 
Come on, we can do this. She's half dead. Her team of four stars and a level 50 Pyramus can do this. <laughs> It'll be good. I think Amy has a team buff though, and I don't really care about buffs. It's damage. I really only want characters with a debuff. You see? Yeah, that's a buff. Got it. Just swap these guys around so they can uh, do their um thing. Oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Thanks. Luckily, we can. We've got a half AF bar, so we can do that. Would you like to test my power? Okay. Importantly, she has Dragon Origin stacks, which means she's gonna more armor every time she hits. Like really fast. I try to position the skills so that ones I want to use in another force are all right there, and I just click, click, click. And the problem is, characters who need their skills like switch between in another force, I'm not very good at. I'm not very good at that. For all my battles against the Gobberins for not, clearly I need to train more. I'd be honored to fight again you again sometime. That's lovely, but we're not going to fight you right now because uh, you're going to be level level 60 and I don't know if I can handle it. Although the Harem, harem King, hello there. Oh yeah, we were, we were going to Rind before I got sidetracked by trying to fight a zombie. able to at least defeat her twice with my poor little three stars. Tired. And we need to go heal. Tyrion just took a beating for the team on that one. I need something sugary. You know what? It was worth it. We prevailed. But mostly Tyrion prevailed. We really need to get some people up to her so that she's not the only one who's strong. <laughs> poor Tyrion. Just pulling up weight. We're a small village, but all our hospitality is yours if you want it. Why not rest a while? Is this a blind playthrough? No, it is not. I've played before on... I have a mobile account that I play on. Um, I'm replaying the game on Steam. Can't come to Rend and not eat this. Here, take this. actually started playing on the around the global launch of the mobile version i'm trying to i'm trying to be better this time by better i mean not rely on my five star characters but instead i'm just relying on tiramis so i'm not better it is new for grimthorpe 101 though he has not seen it oh thank you for following although the harem king are you the town healer Carpenter from Unigan said you might have some medicine to soothe the pain in his legs. I get a lot of requests like that these days. Aren't there any decent healers in Unigan? Give me a minute. Here you go. Tell your friend to rub this onto his legs. It takes some time to work, but once it kicks in, he'll be right as rain. It's slow acting, huh? I guess that means Ketchum will have to rest a little bit longer. Oh, this is for Ketchum? He's a regular around here. Knowing him, he's probably going a little crazy not being able to get back to work. Yeah, he said his professional pride was on the line. Ho oh ho, sounds like him. In that case, there is a way to enhance this cell. Fused with sickle grass from the Serena, Serena, Serena coast, it'll take effect a lot faster. That sounds complicated. It's easy enough if you know how. Bring me the grass and I'll see what I can do. Sure, getting back to work as soon as possible might be the best thing to get Ketchum in a good mood again. When in doubt, Tiramis, Tiramis, Tiramis. That, that's pretty much how things have been going. Uh, she, she, she's been doing well. Uh, these poor people are still three stars. Uh, we're, we're doing side quests now because um, Tiramis alone cannot not defeat um, not defeat the Altana Faini Fene Beast combo. We, we got a little owned by them last time. Now we're doing some side quests, uh, trying to level up some of our other people. I want to try and get these guys to four stars at least. I don't know if that'll help that much, but it's what I want to do. Enemy. 
I've been neglecting the side quests a bit as well. Having a good time doing the story again. It's, uh, it's been a while. Also collecting the cats. I love the cats. Why I originally installed this game, I was like, cats? Of course. Got some sickle grass. Okay, there's the other grass. Oh, wait, I remembered what I was, I was trying to tell you this before, from, and I got really distracted. Uh, there's a new banner now. It is... Where is it? We go past all the paid ones. Is this a free one? Yeah, this is a free one. There's a new character. It's, um, Munfa AS, another style. That came out today. Well, actually, last night. For my... We can do a poll on that if you want. No, know how you feel about it, but we can do it. Do it. You do like me to get it. Not. Scroll down to the tea maiden. Do a ten pull. What shall we get today? I'm gonna click through this. I get bored. You're always gonna promote gambling. Got a Chio. Already had Chio. And. And Chio. <laughs> uh, for some reason, I was almost expecting a third Chio. <laughs> that would be really unlikely. Another, uh. Hey, life itself is a gamble. Mm. Same. Fair enough. Isis. I try to pronounce their names, but I have some trouble with them. M's. Urania. I wish they'd do something for the Rainbow Sisters eventually, because I actually like them. Ryuna? Ryuna? Oh, it's not old. Well, that was not the most exciting pull. But, you know, we got some new people and double Chios. So we're always promoting gambling. <laughs> From the Order of the Fliore. Uh, things to say. I'm still a little green, but it's my dream to be a strong, cool knight like Bria. You can count on me. I am Isis, Vice Captain of the Order of the Fleareth. Have you seen my captain anywhere? Oh, her name's Isis. Dang, not quite as good as Tiramis' first try. I can't take my eyes off her nah. for one minute. It's a wonder she ever gets any work done. Can I say we can't always get Tiramis and Coco? Sometimes. Who do you think you are? You're in the presence of the ever wise and brilliant Nunold. Sometimes we get <laughs> Nunold instead. My brain is a treasure of the human race. I seek worldly knowledge to further my unbridled intellect. You look like a perfect subject to observe. You've piqued my interest. <laughs> Goodbye, Nunold. Okay, back to our questing. We have 60 characters. I just want to walk down the road and I get attacked. All for. It's my dream to become a strong, okay, cool knight like Bria. Next? Proceeds to remain a three-star unit. I guess she's not she's not getting her dream any anytime soon, if ever. Monsters leap from the shadows. Who could have foreseen this coming? Monster fight. Side quest. Pyramus, kill them all. Okay. Yeah, I got the simple grass. I'm gonna walk back because the map takes a while to load. Do I just run straight from here? I don't, unfortunately. I guess we can try fighting these guys now also, but not right now. We'll probably run out of action. Not action, please. MP. I should know more about these things, but I don't. It is a pity. I love, I love these backgrounds. They're just they're like the Serena Coast or, or Serena, Serena Coast. I don't know why. I always want to call it Serena. Challenge me. 
just looks so peaceful. Most areas look very nice and okay. peaceful. Who's I'm just next? enjoying them and then the monsters attack. Very rude, really. Just trying to enjoy the scenery. Okay. Oh, I forgot I can run around with the map open. <laughs> very convenient. Back to the healer. I have not stolen your stuff. Rano Coast would be pretty spicy. <laughs> yeah, probably too spicy for me. Splendid, you got the materials we need. Now watch and be amazed. Sounds good. First we mash this into a paste, then blend it with the other. Not to let it get lumpy. And ta-da! Alchemy like this never ceases to move me. I keep some of the finished product for myself. Alchemy my foot, you just mix them together. Just my little joke. You see, catch him, remind him he's got a tab that needs pain. I hope he's not going to overdo things again. Thanks. I'll take it to him right now. Took a bite out of one when you were cooking with them and regretted it. <laughs> yeah, I, I... I don't imagine just biting a pepper is all that wise. Especially one that isn't mild. Well, I don't really know how spicy a serrano pepper is. I can't eat peppers. Thanks. I'll take it to him right now. Let's, uh, get this medicine to that carpenter. This time we will open the map because it is faster than running all the way through the Serena Coast. Serena. Serena Coast on foot. I guess it is Serene. Think of that. Some things are just difficult, like how I keep wanting to call her Cecil instead of Cecile. There's a lot of quests that we can do. Well, actually, there's two. Okay, we've been we've been whittling down. Ooh, the pain. Ah, hey there, young fella. You sure took your time. You should be grateful. I had to go find some extra components to power up this cell. Here you go. Hand it over the medicine. Thanks, buddy. I'll put it on now. Ketchum rubs the salve on his legs. Whoa, what the heck is this stuff? It feels like all my pain vanished in the wink of an eye. Seems like they can be up to five times hotter than jalapenos from a quick Google. Sounds pretty spicy! I'm gonna go for a jog. That looks more like a run. Wow, she wasn't kidding about the fast acting part. Oh hey, you're back. Woo-wee, nothing like that feeling of the wind in your hair. No one's gonna stop me now. Well, he's happy. Wait for Ketchum to return. Phew, I'm working up a great sweat. That's, uh, great. Time to get back to work. Gotta make up for all that lost time. Thanks again, fella. No problem. Listen, I know the repair works are important, but don't push yourself too hard, alright? Sure there wasn't something stronger in that salve? Honestly, I don't know what was in that salve. Aside from the grass we went and got. I get what you're saying, but a big job like this is the stuff of dreams. Never taken on a project of this scale before. Rushed off my feet, but loving every minute. If only I had him here with me. Ah, guess that's just wishful thinking. Who do you mean? Just talking to myself. Don't you worry about it. Take care of yourself. Yeah, good luck with everything. Don't work too hard. And he's gone. You never told him about the tab! The lady wanted him to tell him about the tab! Eh, I guess his tab isn't going anywhere. Bruise of a carpenter complete! I guess we can work on these two quests hanging out in. Oh wait, did, did we get... You tend to get your, um... Rolls from side quests. See if we can give Amy's a nice XP scroll. There we go, we got some XP scrolls for Amy to eat. Here you go, Amy. Let's actually just get her up to level 40. And then get see if we can get Aldo up to, Aldo up to level 40 as well. Yeah. Let's eat these scrolls, my people. Punch them down. There we go. Here we go. We're doing, doing pretty well, I would think. Okay, let's be 
magic in this man's house, so we will help him with his quest. Shocking super energy. A scholar in Unigan is researching alternative energy sources to Prisma. Lightning is apparently the key. Oh, you must be the assistant I ordered. What? Me? No, I'm just here to raid your house. I've been waiting for you. We have a lot of work to do. Wait, what are you talking about? Ah, forgive me. I haven't introduced myself. My name is Scott. Currently researching a possible new energy source. What kind of source? Have you ever seen lightning? Of course, during storms and stuff. I got to thinking. A lightning strike produces light, sound, even destruction. Why can't we harness that power? Now, have you ever touched a metal object and gotten a shock from it? Yeah, now you mention it, it always spooks me when that happens. Indeed, that moment your finger touches the metal, it's like a miniature lightning strike. Passes through you in an instant. No way, how could it be lightning if there aren't any thunderclouds? Where is it coming from? Don't be so fast to write off this theory, think outside the box a little. Just imagine how much easier our lives would be if we could contain that lightning energy and use it whenever we wanted. It could be the biggest step forward for human civilization since the discovery of Prisma. Bigger, even. So you're looking for a way to summon rain clouds or something? No, think about those tiny shocks. They can happen when there isn't a cloud in the sky. If it has nothing to do with the weather, we must be overlooking something. That's where you come in. I want you to find me something capable of inflicting that tingly, shocky, shocking feeling. Something that can shock, huh? I've got to admit, I'd like to see where your research might lead. And trying to invent electricity. Well said. Curiosity is essential in the ma in matters such as these. I guess it's not invented. He's trying to discover electricity. Now, are you familiar with the monsters called gentia that live in the swamp? Eating them causes your tongue to tingle, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I know them all right. You've got to be careful not to bite into one too hard or your whole mouth goes numb. That's because of their poison. Their venom glands secrete it constantly. It gets mixed into the water around them. We're not expecting this storyline. <laughs> They need to have those glands removed to be eaten safely. See where I'm going with this, yes? Now go oh, gather some gentia venom glands so we can get started. Nope, I have no idea where you're going with this, but I guess I can go to the swamp and hunt down a couple of gentia. This guy seems kind of eccentric. I think his heart's in the right place. Time to help him on his shocking quest. Sorry, that was... It wasn't even really... Okay, it was so bad. I like looking at the little map. It makes me happy. I like clicking on these two. Look, look how beautiful that is. Lovely. Start some side stories too. We really should do at some point, but for now, I want to work on all these side quests I've been neglecting. These poor common folks, they need their problems resolved. It is quite the pretty game. I, I, I enjoy the art style. I was like, I thought I was supposed to be fighting something in the Swampland, but then I was like, oh wait, it's one of those quests where I just need to find them and kill them. There's some. I think Summoner's Ritual should be enough to deal with these guys. Yeah, okay, so she can save mana on these guys. Did you see my graceful moves? Got two? Need three more. Wish I did more overworld interactions. It's very lovely here. I like talking to the little, like, the little party okay. characters. It's fun. Huh. We're making good progress with the Gentia. I don't think that's how you pronounce it. I'm gonna pronounce it, though. It, there really isn't that much to do in these locations, really. I can run around and kill monsters later on, which is kind of sad. I'd like to have more reason to come hang out in these places. Your stars show a sad but I guess I can just come look at them if I want to. Take that! Like how they had a hidden side quest for that weapon. Okay, who's next? I don't remember which one. Maybe I never found it. I'm not sure. True. Wish to die? Step forward. Uh, we already got it. That was convenient. 
Are we gonna have to do some extra fighting? Because I kind of ran farther than necessary. <laughs> oh well. Bye bye, Shion. We do not have a Shion. I'm gonna send you flying. I mean, I guess it's not that big a loss. The one where you Double had to age the metal between multiple errors. Oh yeah, that was really fun. I liked that a lot. And I am very sad now. Actually, we can start that quest. No? I forgot about it. It's, I, was try I got caught up in trying to do the Beast King Castle and uh, not being able to do it. <laughs> I relied too much on Tiramis. No one can defeat a dragon summoner. I have other characters, though. But it's not like we're, uh... Not like we're, uh, stuck at all. I just really went with the story people more because I like them a lot. Hey, I got you the gland. Mm, yes, very good. Just what we need. Let's see what makes these things tick. <laughs> Uh, hey, is that safe? Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. I just apply it to my skin and... and... I don't think he knows what he's doing. For some reason. <laughs> and nothing happens. Curious, there's no trace of that sharp, tingling shock. Just a strong sense of lethargy. Are you okay? Oh, I'm starting to go numb all over. This wasn't the result I was expecting. How disappointing. You're being way too blasé about this. Let's get this poison off you. Wash the gentia venom off Sky. Jeez, that was a close one. What were you thinking? That experiment could have killed you. Small price to pay for science. Never mind about that. I remembered some rumors about the Serena Coast. They say sparks have been flying out of the sea. It must be a life form capable of controlling lightning. Dear assistant, go find it and bring it to me. You're not giving up yet? Besides, those rumors sound pretty crazy to me. A creature like that even exists. Better go check it out. Hey, don't do anything weird while I'm gone. Yeah. We, we might need to worry about this guy. He's a little overenthusiastic. But I I don't think he I don't think he's gonna kill himself off. We have to return to him. Uh I do hate having to just because I'm patient though. Might suffer mild death. And who's who's who are we supposed to turn in our quests to if our quest givers die? That's why they can't die. They have to live forever. Okay. Get on your knees and surrender. Let's see if summoners were chosen. These guys. It is. Oh, I'm always glad when I get to use less MP to kill all the trash enemies. Not insult them like that, but I will. Age Master Mania, hello, hello, hello there. You're a fool to challenge me. We're doing some side quests. We are too weak to fight. Um, we make a good team. What is it called? East Angel Geo Ang Anguirus. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll settle with that. Pronunciation. That's probably wrong. Oh no, my map is getting small because I ran into an enemy. Asta, forces detected. I've been neglecting a whole lot of sites. So we're no working on this. Also, we uh we fought uh Shata Wilson09. We fought her twice. Uh, she's gonna be level 60 next time. I don't know if we can handle that. <laughs> Okay, here we are. No sign of this lightning creature yet. Oh, there's some lightning. Whoa, what the heck was that? The whole ocean lit up for a second. Maybe the thing Scott was talking about really does exist. Only one way to find out for sure. After a fierce struggle, you got a shocking fish. Woo, I got it with my bare hands, too. I'd probably make a pretty good fisherman. So this was what was making all those sparks fly? I'll just give it a little poke. Yard. Man, that stinks. You pack a real punch for such a little guy. 
Better be careful with this on my way back. Maybe this time Scott will find out something useful. Time to run all the way back to the other side. Oh, there's a loot back there. Well, you know what? You know what? Let's see. Oh, darn. Let's see if we can take on take on level 60 as on I imagine we can't, but we can try. Nothing to stop my poor judgment. Hostiles eliminated. But I think she'll annihilate my poor, uh, poor three stars. Need to eat a food. Perfect with a pinch of salt and some seafood. Very good. And then I want to. I want to. Actually, I do want to swap these two. That's good. Hello again. I won't allow myself to be caught off guard again. I've been working on an entirely new training regimen. Must remain strictly confidential, of course. Well, since you've helped me out so much already, I guess it won't hurt to tell you. Tommy gains more resistance in each fight. Hmm. I got my hands on a curious scroll. Apparently it holds the secret to maintaining a calm mind under pressure. Would you like to see the fruits of my labor? No magic units. She will already she debuffs it intelligence. In that case, how about another sparring match? My thanks. My focus is now as keen as my blade. Prepare yourself. Uh, I think this is going to go poorly because our only damage deal okay. dealing unit is, um, Aramis. <laughs> Everyone else is kind of sad. So, uh, this isn't going to go well. Let's fight till the end. We barely managed to defeat her at level 50. So, uh, I think we're gonna get wiped out here in a moment. Whenever she decides to, uh, to hard hit. Could the P5 characters help you out here? Uh, they could if I acquired them! <laughs> I should, uh, probably do that. Gosh, we've pretty much just been doing the main story so far. So we don't have any of the, uh... Side any of the uh, collaboration characters yet? If you remember correctly, they make this fight way easier. Probably. I uh, need you to heal. I don't know if you. Have, I can look if you have to buff. Can't I? How do I? I see. Okay, I don't care. Oh. Have to need those. I'm gonna switch her back in. And dragons. Oh, he's dead. That's what he saw, though. Would you like to get you hats? Hello. Uh, Terry could clap. She ignores defense. Yeah, she could do better if um I had more stuff from her for her. This is uh, she. She still needs a bit more gear and uh, her final can't do her final quest yet. Joker, the joke. My three stars are going down. I can't take it. Front line, front line. Heal. I guess it pretty much depends who she decides to get up. She's not starting her, uh. Group. It's my turn. My strength is this just a replay yours. of the game? I have played it before on mobile. I'm playing, um, on Steam now. Long time since I got to play the beginning parts. Also trying to be less bad. Uh, I can I can make it faster. I usually have it slow. Sorry about that. I'm kind of a very casual, very casual player. See how much damage we can do in uh, another. Probably not near enough. We've only got a half bar, but we can have a little fun hitting her before she kills us. That was very sad, actually. There goes Cyrus. Where's Ritual? Heal. 
that matters. Does it only go- oh, there's Amy. She pretty much just knocks out a character each turn. <laughs> yeah. I think it's a little much to ask of the Tiramis to be the only one who can do anything and at a level disadvantage. Hello. Oh, down she goes. Yeah, we can't- we can't handle that. That's her. Working hard, though. Limit reached. Unable to fight. Zombie rip. We, we have we have been ripped by a zombie. But you know what? Now we're where we needed to be to finish that quest. So, really, it was all for the best. That, that's what I'm gonna say. It, it was it was all for the best. Welcome back. Do you have some good news for me? Tada! One fish that shocks just like lightning. Cats need to unionize all this overtime they're working. They, they do they do be doing a lot of work for me, because I keep dying. <laughs> Wonderful. Assistants like you are hard to find. Now let's take a look. You need a debuff. If you wanted to combat a zombie with your current team. Yeah. My, my poor people right now are uh greatest position. Mostly I think because I've been rushing kind of the story. Whoa, hold on. Don't touch it or guard. Tried to warn you. Oh my, oh my, Eureka. This is the sensation I've been seeking to recreate. This phenomenon and lightning strikes are one and the same. Good work, my boy. This might just open the door to a technological revolution. Yayarg. Hey, I told you not to touch it, remember? Jeez, you've got to be more careful. Hurts much worse than a little shock from a metal object. What power? <laughs> I'm feeling lightheaded. Is this the joy of discovery? Hey, are you all right? If I can unravel the mysteries behind this prisma, will become obsolete. Yarg. Well, he's happy. I think she needs at least all four stars, since a full five-star team is nowhere near easy to create at this point. Oh, I can make a full five-star team? What kind of playthrough is this? Like, story only in Tiramis? Uh, it's just... kind of... whatever. I'm using Tiramis because she makes the mob clears easy. I do want to use more of the story characters. Um, I have other characters, but they're like a good some of them. Oh, where are they? I, I try to level them a bit. That's my five stars. I try to level them a bit, um, but I really want to make more use of these guys. These guys, because I never did before. I'm very bad. I'm very bad in another Eden, and I want to get better, so that's why I'm trying to use story characters. Oh, they would break the early game. Yeah, like I, I yeah, like we, we got Nakoko on a on a free five free free ten pull. It was it was pretty amazing. I uh I credit Grimthorpe for that. He said, Yeah, do a pull on that. And then we got a we got a five star Nakoko. So we're not breaking her out yet. She she she'll make our lives too easy. Carpenter and Unigan want someone to find his son. Listen to what he has to say. So yeah, we're, we're trying to use more free care, I guess is what the idea is. Hey there, young fella. How have you been? Hi, Ketchum. How's your carpentry? Do you have any more problems with your legs? AS Shannon and AS Vilmina? Yeah. I got them off of, um, what were they? Because I actually started this account when it launched on Steam. So I have a four-star, uh, Suzette. And I logged in to get the, there have been two brilliant brilliant drops no not brilliant drops the, the things where you log in and do the the one pull for 10 days and you get and then you get a free five star that's how i got for me shannon don't remind me that was so embarrassing as for my work well i'm getting by you look kind of gloomy is it too much for you to handle alone hate to admit it but yeah i'm making some progress but overall it's not shaping up as well as i'd like I, I have a son, name of Rongo. About six months back, he left the house to gallivant around. Hasn't been back since. The boy's a pretty competent carpenter, plus he knows how I work. I feel like I could get a lot more done if he was here. Gosh, that's right. I hope he comes home to you soon. Oh well, though, you know we have to go find him. <laughs> Wait a sec, I have an idea. How about you go find him for me? He's around the same age as you. What? He's been goofing off for half a year now. What could I possibly say to convince him to get back to work? 
Maybe I didn't make enough of an effort to understand the boy, but a young fella like you might be able to get through to him. Just because we're the same age doesn't mean we'd have anything in common. Can't you at least give it a try? You're the only one I can turn to for help. Well, alright. It's better for everyone if we can get the castle fixed up again soon. Thanks, man. I swear I'll make this up to you someday. I'll be over at the castle walls if you need me. That man likes running. Sure, why not? Not like I'm doing anything important right now. Let's start by asking around. Accepted. Like the quest accepted here. Makes it sound so enthusiastic. Even when you're just looking for someone's son who will be swift at Let him. So, sir. Rongo the carpenter. He came by a while back with a shady looking bunch. Hope he's not fallen into bad company. That's one of the fun things is I don't really remember a lot of these side quests just so long ago I played them originally. Sure, I was friends with Rongo when we were kids. We've grown apart lately, though. Ever since his mom passed away, he's changed little by little. Some people even say he's become some kind of bandit. One more. Uh -oh. Carpenter's son? Oh yeah, I think I saw him passing through town a little while back. He was heading for the Serena coast with a group of friends. I don't think they came back this way, though. Oh, the Serena coast. Probably should try and fight at least first as well. Probably the one next to the zombie because there's got to be a loot behind it with how it's positioned. That one. One of the other main reasons to get up to a point where I can progress the story some more is so I can, uh, I can farm her, um, we fight for the same cause. her bracelet thing. The thing from the other way. They're supposed to be on the screen. Maybe they went to Rind. Maybe I was supposed to ask around some more. I should probably. Jeremus is such broke. Time is a luxury we don't have. He does make dealing with these regular guys so much faster. Like I remember absolutely hating some of the like long dungeon areas originally because they were so slow. Um, because of the enemies. Oh. forces detected. She just makes everything so nice. That is why I use her. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't give it up. She's so convenient. We're gonna kill this fish. Well, hopefully we're gonna kill this fish. Strong enemy. Yeah, we can That's kill this fish. More debuffs. Debuff them minor My strength is yours! Everything moves so fast on double speed. Does it go faster? No. Does one ring go faster than double speed? I don't really need resistance. Oh. There we go. No, please tell me. Please tell me you didn't feel Let's her ability. Until the end. Okay. All is good. You don't have to be sad. Swap you guys around because I feel like it. I think everyone's gonna survive even. I guess they have enough health Attention. now that they don't die too easily. I always am afraid they're gonna die though. I don't like when my people die, I want them all to live. My strength is yours! No mercy. They're fun. I love my little people. Probably not good to like collecting. Did you oh. see my graceful moon? I don't I don't want to spend with this account. <laughs> Spirit bracelet. Maybe they're in Rind? We're gonna go check Rind. And we'll come back someday to defeat a zombie. Not today. Need to at least get these guys up to ours, I think. Get on your knees and surrender! Then it'll probably be easier. I'm also really appreciating the thing that lets you um 
that makes it so you can keep your attacks between combats. Because I can just set Tiramis on whichever um, level of her dragon summoning ability. Uh, wipes the enemies in the area, and then just press A every time. It's great. We're gonna rest here, because... I took up all my mana and uh, got my people beat up. For no real reason, apparently. Why? Okay. Thank you for your delish fish. I was supposed to report to catch him. Now, now I just feel very lost. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. The game crashed on me. But actually, it never hung up and then crashed. It always just crashed. Oh, yes, I would like to move to you. For some reason, like when I got to the golem defending the uh, towers. Anytime I started that, it crashed, but I reacquired data and everything, and then, it, and then it worked fine, so... I don't know what the problem was, but it fixed itself. How did it go? Did you find out anything about my boy? Listen, there's no easy way to say this, but I'm not hearing a lot of good things. You tell Ketchum about the rumors. He's gone and joined up with a troop of bandits. What is that kid thinking? From the sound of things, they're still close by, somewhere on the coast. Bad news for them, I'm gonna go knock some sense into Rongo and drag him home if I have to. Hey, wait for me. Now we go to the Serena Coast. I was a little, a little bit ahead of where I was supposed to be. Can be a problem. Uh, it is very serene on the coast. Okay, over there. We already collected all these cats. Cats. Nice. Get over here. These flowers are very pretty. Too. I love them. Suppressing enemy. Ritual. Have to deal with all this. There we go. Now we can help this man reunite with his son. Rongo, there you are. Hey, what's with this geezer? Dad. Pretty far from home, aren't you, old man? I had to see the truth with my own eyes. Have you really joined these brigands? Are you robbing harmless travelers? But what if I am? It's got nothing to do with you. You're a disgrace. I'm bringing you home where you can't get into any more trouble. Just try and make me. You're crazy if you think I'm going to follow in your footsteps. Rongo, this is that no good dad of yours, the one that abandoned your mom. What did you say? Never mind. Come on, let's get out of here. Rongo and his allies leave. Ketchum, are you okay? I abandoned his mother? Is that what he thinks? Rongo, what are you trying to say? Oops. Didn't run that time. That big belly sad. complete! You know, when the quest is like the middle of a quest line, a series of quests, and it ends on a sad note, and then it plays that cheerful quest complete music, I feel a little conflicted. Like, I want to be happy. Because that music is so cheerful. But on the other hand, the people are sad and I still need to resolve their issues. Or help them resolve their issues, I guess. It's, uh... It's confusing. Okay, there's one more quest left here in this area. There could be some in the castle. I haven't checked. Got one over by this cat. Truth entrusted to the dead. The widow in Unigan wants her husband's belongings returned to Miglant's castle. Oh, 
What am I supposed to do now? This is unacceptable. Something wrong, ma'am? Stay calm. You might hurt yourself. How can I be calm at a time like this? I need to collect my husband's effects, but no one at the castle will help me. Effects? You mean... Yes, he passed away in the battle with the Beast Folk Army. He was such a big, sturdy oaf, too. I always thought nothing less than a giant could possibly best him. Sorry for your loss. Things have finally started to calm down. I thought it'd be a good time to collect his old stuff. I've asked the soldiers, but they're no help. They just keep repeating the same old warnings about the castle not being safe here. At this rate, I may as well just go there and hunt around for his things myself. I don't think you should do that. It really might not be safe here. You must have really loved your husband to care this much about collecting his old stuff. <laughs> nothing so sentimental as that. He was a good-for-nothing playboy. Most nights, I didn't even know where he was. He did bother to come home. I could always smell other women's perfume on him. Flying snake. Oh, okay. So why is his stuff so important to you? After everything he put me through, I deserve it. It's a valuable antique dagger he'd been keeping all these years. It should fetch a good price. Hurt. Just thinking about him makes my blood boil. That's it. I'm going. Going very slowly. No, hold on a second. It's the dagger you want, right? I'll find it for you. Just stay here and don't do anything rash. You'd do that for me? How kind. You'll know the dagger by the large crimson jewel in itself. Okay, it's gotta be somewhere inside Migland's castle. I'm gonna go investigate the castle. I do wish they would repair the castle. It's kinda sad. That it's, I guess it's partially so that you permanently have an excuse to never open up more parts of it, but but it's sad. <laughs> Look at this gate. It's so fancy. Shiny. I like it a lot. Go there. Want to know about fallen soldiers' possessions. Usually we return them to their families, but some items have gone missing. Can you believe someone would take advantage of this tragedy and steal from the dead? It happened about two weeks back, a whole lot of personal effects vanished. Hey, you got an alibi for that time? Nah, yeah, there's no way the thief would be bold enough to come back. Sawyera. Oh, no one in there who is helpful. Second floor of my house. There we go, more people to talk to. Some beast folk managed to sneak in a couple of weeks back. There was something strange about them. They didn't attack anyone or try to damage anything. I only saw them for a second, but it seemed like they took something and ran. What could they have been after? This man. Suspicious incidents. Well, they say some beast folk infiltrated the castle a while back. It caused an uproar, I can tell you. Apparently, they managed to escape and made for the Serena Coast. Back to the Serena Coast. Stolen items? Pip. Beast folk taken some. It all adds up. I'm probably on the right track anyway. Might still be on the Serena Coast. Better try to catch them if I want to get that dagger back. Let us acquire the dagger. Serena Coast. I'm starting to get over calling it the Serena Coast. He did not think about it, though. Another quest appeared! How rude. Oh, that's probably the, the carpenter's son. Yeah, that, 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 that'd, that'd be in sense. It's the next part of that quest. Off we go, back to the coast. But these areas are so pretty, or I'd probably get annoyed at having to go back to them all the time. Although it would be easier if I just picked up all the quests at once and did them, but... I get confused about which stories go with which ones to do that, so it's easier for me to do them sequentially instead of at the same time. Okay. Nice. Did you see my grace? Get my other people up to a better level, and then maybe I won't have to rely on Tyrannus as much. That'd be pretty nice. She does make life so easy. So there. What do you want with us, human? 
sneak into Minglan's castle two weeks ago. That's how you always prefer to do quests and everything, sequentially? Yeah. Who wants to know? It was you. Then you must have stolen a dagger with a red stone, too. This is the one you mean? So sorry, but I've taken a liking to it. Finders keepers, that's the life. I have a feeling my associates back at the Beast King's castle will pay top gift for it. That belongs to the widow of a brave soldier who fell in battle. I'm taking it back. Do your thing, Tiramis. These guys are strong. I think they're, um, what do you call it? Quest dudes. I mean, if I did this one, it'd probably be bad. But they don't die to her level one one. Good for them. Well, I got it back, but... Got a broken dagger. Snapped right in two during our fight. Must have been pretty old. Better go find that lady and face the music. Oh good, we can just run on this road all the way back. Okay, that's a little disappointing, actually. Run with the map open. Wish to die? Step forward. Yeah. Wish Helena had an AoE. No one can defeat a dragon I like summoner. Her. I like Helena and Cyrus a lot. They're probably my favorite story characters. And it probably has a lot to do with the fact that Helena is purple. Because I like purple. And Cyrus is the frog man. Okie dokie, hello. You're back. Ma'am, I'm so sorry. Eh, what's the matter? Beast folk stole your late husband's dagger. I managed to get it back, but there was a scuffle and, well... Hand over the broken dagger. Oh my, you really did a number on it. Don't know what to say. So sorry. Ha ha ha, don't worry, young man. You say the beast folk had it? Glad you made it back in one piece. That's nice of you to say. Besides, it looks like this wasn't the priceless antique I'd taken. It did come apart pretty easily. Now I look at it a little more closely. This part near the hilt is hollow. You're right. No wonder it was so fragile. Aha, something's in this hollow space. It's a letter for me. Let's take a look. My beloved wife, thank you for sticking with a complete no-hoper like me all these years. You haven't been shy about voicing your complaints, but still, you never gave up on me. Wanted to find a way to repay you. Been earning a little extra money by working nights as a rich man's bodyguard. I have enough now to buy something you've always wanted. Remember our special place? You said you'd love to live somewhere like that someday. I hope you'll like it, my love. A little house by the sea, just for us. Maybe when this war is over, we can get it furnished and move in. What do you think of that? If I don't come back, feel free to do whatever you want with the house. You should fetch a decent price on the market. Just forget about me and live your life. My only wish is for you to be happy. Writing these words is more embarrassing than I thought. Not that anyone can see me. Probably best if I don't send this letter after all. I'll tell you the good news in person. Saving money to buy you a home. We talked about living by the sea way back before we were married. I thought he'd forgotten all about it. Your only wish is for me to be happy. Big galoot. How can I be happy without you? Too late for that now. Widow reads the letter over and over again. Sniff. I'm, I'm alright. Sorry for putting you through all this trouble. Not at all. Are you really okay? Yes, thank you. I'll move into that house and save up all my gripes to give him when we see each other in the next life. I'm sure you're gonna be fine. I'll go and take a look at that house right now. Thanks again. Funny how one little object had so many stories attached to it. Recent trust to the dead complete. Now, sad we don't have Mario. We're gonna do. We're gonna feed whatever the scrolls we have, uh, probably to Amy. Amy, eat the scrolls. 
eat them. Caught up with... No, no, it's ahead of everyone else, but it's okay. He's getting there. Okay. I think that's a good, a good amount for today. Over an hour is a bit long for me to stream, so... Uh, my voice gets tired. <laughs> I think that will uh, be all for today. So, thank you for coming, everyone. Uh, thank you for following Aldo the Harem King. Uh, thank you. What did we all have? We had a lot of people today. Pikachu hats, Brimfork 101, Aldo the Harem King, Sage Master Mania. I think I forgot someone. Shadow Wilson 09. Thank you, everybody, for coming by. Uh, goodbye. <laughs>